Shash previously, Statistical Analysis System, is a software suite developed by Shash Institute for Advanced Analytics, Multivariate Analyses, Business Intelligence, Data Management, and Predictive Analytics. Shash was developed at North Carolina State University from 1966 until 1976, when Shash Institute was incorporated. Shash was further developed in the 1980s and 1990s with the addition of new statistical procedures, additional components and the introduction of JMP. A point-and-click interface was added in version 9 in 2004. A social media analytics product was added in 2010. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Technical overview and terminology. Shash is a software suite that can mine, alter, manage and retrieve data from a variety of sources and perform statistical analysis on it. Shash provides a graphical point and click user interface for non-technical users and more advanced options through the Shash language. Shash programs have data steps which retrieve and manipulate data and proc steps which analyze the data. Each step consists of a series of statements. The data step has executable statements that result in the software taking an action and declarative statements that provide instructions to read a data set or alter the data's appearance. The data step has two phases, compilation and execution. In the compilation phase, declarative statements are processed and syntax errors are identified. Afterwards, the execution phase processes each executable statement sequentially. Data sets are organized into tables with rows called observations and columns called variables. Additionally, each piece of data has a descriptor and a value. The proc step consists of proc statements that call upon named procedures. Procedures perform analysis and reporting on data sets to produce statistics, analyses, and graphics. There are more than 300 procedures and each one contains a substantial body of programming and statistical work. Proc statements can also display results, sort data or perform other operations. Shash macros are pieces of code or variables that are coded once and referenced to perform repetitive tasks. Shash data can be published in HTML, PDF, Excel and other formats using the output delivery system, which was first introduced in 2007. The Shash Enterprise Guide is SAS's point-and-click interface. It generates code to manipulate data or perform analysis automatically and does not require Shash programming experience to use. The Shash software suite has more than 200 components Some of the Shash components include History Origins. <laughs> 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 The development of Shash began in 1966 after North Carolina State University rehired Anthony Barr to program his analysis of variance and regression software so that it would run on IBM System 360 computers. The project was funded by the National Institute of Health and was originally intended to analyze agricultural data to improve crop yields. Barr was joined by student James Goodnight, who developed the software's statistical routines, and the two became project leaders. In 1968, Barr and Goodnight integrated new multiple regression and analysis of variance routines. In 1972, after issuing the first release of Shash, the project lost its funding. According to Goodnight, this was because NIH only wanted to fund projects with medical applications. Goodnight continued teaching at the university for a salary of $1 and access to mainframe computers for use with the project, until it was funded by the university statisticians of the Southern Experiment Stations the following year. John Sal joined the project in 1973 and contributed to the software's econometrics, time series, and matrix algebra. Another early participant, Carol G. Perkins, contributed to Shash early programming. Jolaine W. Service and Jane T. Helwig created Shash first documentation. The first versions of Shash were named after the year in which they were released. In 1971, Shash 71 was published as a limited release. It was used only on IBM mainframes and had the main elements of Shash programming, such as the data step and the most common procedures in the PROC step. The following year a full version was released as Shash 72, which introduced the merge statement and added features for handling missing data or combining data sets. In 1976, Barr, Goodnight, Sal, and Helwig removed the project from North Carolina State and incorporated it into Shash Institute, Inc. Development. Shash was redesigned in Shash 76 with an open architecture that allowed for compilers and procedures. The input and INFILE statements were improved so they could read most data formats used by IBM mainframes. Generating reports was also added through the put and file statements. The ability to analyze general linear models was also added as was the format procedure, which allowed developers to customize the appearance of data. 
In 1979, Shash-79 added support for the CMS operating system and introduced the datasets procedure. Three years later, Shash-82 introduced an early macro language and the append procedure. Shash version 4 had limited features, but made Shash more accessible. Version 5 introduced a complete macro language, array subscripts, and a full-screen interactive user interface called Display Manager. In 1985, Shash was rewritten in the C programming language. This allowed for the Shash multivendor architecture that allows the software to run on Unix, MS-DOS, and Windows. It was previously written in Place, I, Fortran, and Assembly language. In the 1980s and 1990s, Shash released a number of components to complement Base Shash. Shash Graph, which produces graphics, was released in 1980, as well as the Shash ETS component, which supports econometric and time series analysis. A component intended for pharmaceutical users, Shash PH Clinical, was released in the 1990s. The Food and Drug Administration standardized on Shash PH Clinical for new drug applications in 2002. Vertical products like Shash Financial Management and Shash Human Capital Management, then called CFO Vision and HR Vision respectively, were also introduced. JMP was developed by Shash co-founder John Sal and a team of developers to take advantage of the graphical user interface introduced in the 1984 Apple Macintosh and shipped for the first time in 1989. Updated versions of JMP were released continuously after 2002 with the most recent release being from 2016. Shash version 6 was used throughout the 1990s and was available on a wider range of operating systems, including Macintosh, OS, 2, Silicon Graphics, and Primos. Shash introduced new features through DOT releases. From 6.06 to 6.09, a user interface based on the Windows paradigm was introduced and support for SQL was added. Version 7 introduced the Output Delivery System and an improved text editor. ODS was improved upon in successive releases. For example, more output options were added in version 8. The number of operating systems that were supported was reduced to Unix, Windows and Z, OS, and Linux was added. Shash version 8 and Shash Enterprise Minor were released in 1999. Recent history In 2002, the Text Miner software was introduced. Text Miner analyzes text data like emails for patterns in business intelligence applications. In 2004, Shash version 9.0 was released, which was dubbed, Project Mercury, and was designed to make Shash accessible to a broader range of business users. Version 9.0 added custom user interfaces based on the user's role and established the point-and-click user interface of Shash Enterprise Guide as the software's primary graphical user interface GUI. The Customer Relationship Management CRM features were improved in 2004 with Shash Interaction Management. In 2008 Shash announced Project Unity, designed to integrate data quality, data integration and master data management. Shash sued World Programming, the developers of a competing implementation, World Programming System, alleging that they had infringed SAS's copyright in part by implementing the same functionality. This case was referred from the United Kingdom's High Court of Justice to the European Court of Justice on of August 2010. In May 2012, the European Court of Justice ruled in favor of World Programming, finding that the functionality of a computer program and the programming language cannot be protected by copyright." A free version was introduced for students in 2010. Shash Social Media Analytics, a tool for social media monitoring, engagement and sentiment analysis, was also released that year. Shash Rapid Predictive Modeler which creates basic analytical models using Microsoft Excel, was introduced that same year. JMP9 in 2010 added a new interface for using the R programming language from JMP and an add-in for Excel. The following year, a high-performance computing appliance was made available in a partnership with Teradata and EMC Greenplum. In 2011, the company released Enterprise Minor 7.1. The company introduced 27 data management products from October 2013 to October 2014 and updates to 160 others. At the 2015 Shash Global Forum, it announced several new products that were specialized for different industries, as well as new training software. Topic. Releases date Shash had many releases since 1972. Since release 9.3, Shash – Stat has its own release numbering. Topic. Software products As of 2011 SAS's largest set of products is its line for customer intelligence. Numerous Shash modules for web, social media and marketing analytics may be used to profile customers and prospects, predict their behaviors and manage and optimize communications. 
Shash also provides the Shash fraud framework. The framework's primary functionality is to monitor transactions across different applications, networks and partners and use analytics to identify anomalies that are indicative of fraud. Shash Enterprise GRC governance, risk and compliance provides risk modeling, scenario analysis and other functions in order to manage and visualize risk, compliance and corporate policies. There is also a Shash Enterprise Risk Management product set designed primarily for banks and financial services organizations. Shash products for monitoring and managing the operations of IT systems are collectively referred to as Shashit Management Solutions. Shash collects data from various IT assets on performance and utilization, then creates reports and analyses. Shash performance management products consolidate and provide graphical displays for key performance indicators (KPIs) at the employee, department, and organizational level. The Shash Supply Chain Intelligence product suite is offered for supply chain needs, such as forecasting product demand, managing distribution and inventory and optimizing pricing. There is also a «Shash for Sustainability Management» set of software to forecast environmental, social and economic effects and identify causal relationships between operations and an impact on the environment or ecosystem. Shash has product sets for specific industries, such as government, retail, telecommunications and aerospace and for marketing optimization or high-performance computing. Topic. Comparison to other products In a 2005 article for the Journal of Marriage and Family comparing statistical packages from Shash and its competitors Stata and SPSS, Alan C. Acock wrote that Shash programs provide "...extraordinary range of data analysis and data management tasks", but were difficult to use and learn. SPSS and Stata, meanwhile, were both easier to learn with better documentation, but had less capable analytic abilities, though these could be expanded with paid in SPSS or free in Stata add-ons. ACOC concluded that Shash was best for power users, while occasional users would benefit most from SPSS and Stata. A comparison by the University of California, Los Angeles, gave similar results. Competitors such as Revolution Analytics and Alpine Data Labs advertise their products as considerably cheaper than Shash. In a 2011 comparison, Doug Henshin of Information Week found that startup fees for the three are similar, though he admitted that the starting fees were not necessarily the best basis for comparison. Shash business model is not weighted as heavily on initial fees for its programs, instead focusing on revenue from annual subscription fees. Topic: <laughs> Adoption. According to IDC, Shash is the largest market shareholder in advanced analytics", with 35.4% of the market as of 2013. It is the fifth largest market shareholder for business intelligence by software with a 6.9% share and the largest independent vendor. It competes in the buy market against conglomerates, such as SAP Business Objects, IBM Cognos, SPSS Modeler, Oracle Hyperion, and Microsoft Buy. Shash has been named in the Gartner Leaders Quadrant for Data Integration Tool and for Business Intelligence and Analytical Platforms. A study published in 2011 in BMC Health Services Research found that Shash was used in 42.6% of data analyses in health service research, based on a sample of 1,139 articles drawn from three journals. See also Comparison of numerical analysis software Shash for operations research Comparison of OLAP servers JMP statistical software also from Shash Institute Inc Shash language